Yeah, there are basically three issues involved here. Uh, the first issue is that Twitter, it's been revealed, and we, we knew this, but it's really official now, has been operating as a Democratic Party organ, essentially with Democratic operatives running the company uh, before Elon Musk took over and uh, maybe a little bit now as well. Uh, the second issue is that we have the question of government officials directing Twitter to squelch particular speech, uh, which is a First Amendment violation. Uh, you'll hear a lot of uh, people say, well, it's not a First Amendment violation because it's a private platform. Well, government intervention to squelch speech is a First Amendment violation. And the third issue is, do we have election interference here? And it's apparent that we do, and that would be an in-kind donation on the part of Twitter to the Democratic Party without any recognition or acknowledgement, which is against the law.